welcome everyone. This is Elta's Head to Head. Today we're talking to Andy Yaramadi. I hope you enjoy it. Well, um, first of all, I'm going to try and concentrate on the client that I'm trying to work with and see um, what's, what are the needs of um, the students that I'm working with. If it's a face-to-face -face course, it's just a company course, or if it's um, a university course, obviously it's different. But what I would try to do is focus as much as I could on the needs of the people that I'm working with. And um, it's extremely important for me to give the service that the client is asking for and therefore make the class a very fun place to, to, to be at. And uh, not to forget that as much fun as it makes to, have, um, to learn English, it should also be something that you, um, you add to your knowledge, your previous knowledge of the class should be very challenging for students. So that's what I would do. The first thing I would like my nephew to learn is that ELTIS stands for teamwork. Um, we are different people with different mindsets getting together to create values. And um, um, in my opinion, my nephew has to learn how important teamwork is and how important that item is in, uh, when it comes to ELTIS. The second thing I would like my nephew to learn is the, the, how important is passion and that people have different opinions, different jobs to do, but, but still they have the passion to get together and work together and take time out of their busy schedule. And the third thing, which is very important for me and for my nephew to learn is um, honesty, because the way we do it is, um, as we have many, many different members in, in a beautiful committee, um, everybody is honest in their feedback, everybody talks about, um, critique, constructive critique and, and, and suggestions and we help each other develop uh, whether in teaching or in, um, in performing as a group, as a team. Oh, that's a very funny one now. I, you know, personally I try to be really, I try to be funny and fun. <laughs> in my classes and my style of teaching is based on that and um, I remember there were two instances where I was teaching a, a group of students it was like a class of 2022 and uh, there was this one person who used to like every 30 minutes used to go always ask me can I go on the toilet and I always said yeah sure mr. sir poops a lot <laughs> and everybody was really cracking up and um, and there was a second instance where we had this um, very nice lady who was relatively shy she was like 18 19 years old and um, so every time I wanted to referred to her, I forgot her name. In every lesson she used to ask, she, I used to say, so what's your name? She used to say, for example, Marie or Susan, whatever. And uh, I remember towards the end of the semester, I used to say, because she was blind, I used to call her Tinkerbell. <laughs> she really loved it too. <laughs> Um, if you ask me, teaching, teaching begins with listening. Um, one of the biggest problems that I personally think teachers or mistakes that teachers make is the fact that they don't listen as much as they speak uh, because uh, everybody learns differently and everybody has a different approach to learning. I remember when I was a student in a Spanish class, I hated grammar. I even today I hate grammar and I always wanted to learn grammar in context and unfortunately in that specific class I never got the chance to learn grammar through context or through speaking for example so I think teachers need to listen more often than 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 speak Well, I have thought about it, and to be honest, I would be uh, the Joker. <laughs> I love Joker. I know it's not a superhero, but it's definitely a character. And uh, I love the the controversy that you, and the paradox that you see in Joker's character. And um, 
he's my all-time favorite, definitely. And the movie Joker, by the way. For more information about our organization, contact us at info at LTAS.de. Or if you're interested in participating in one of these interviews or have questions to ask for the interviews, please contact us at social media at LTAS.de. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and also hit the bell so that you're notified every time we come out with a new video. Gracie approves, don't you, girl? That's right, little girly girl. <laughs> Bye.